Willow that was dwelling at Oxenford, a rich knof that Gestus held to board, and of his craft he was a carpenter. With him there was dwelling a poor scholar, had a learned art, but all his fantasy was turned for to learn astrology, and could a certain of conclusions to them and be interrogations, if that men asked him in certain hours, when that men should have drought or else sure, or if men asked him what should befall, of everything he may not reckon him all. This clerk was clipped and the Nicholas, of tern love he could and of solace, and thereto he was slech and full privé, and linga made and menga for to say. A chamra had he in that hostelry, alone without it none company, full fantasy he did with herb as wonta, and he himself as swained as his deronda, of licorice or any set of all. His alma jest and bogus great and small, his astrolabi longing for his art, his augrim stone as laying fair apart, and shelves coochin at his bed is hand, his pressy covered with a falding rain, and all above there lay a gaze out tree, on which he made a nichtus melody, so sweetly that all the chamber rung, and Angelus at virginem he sung. And after that he sung the king is nota. Full often blessed was his myria throta. And thus this way the clerk his team is spent, after his friend is finding and his rent. This carpenter had wedded new a weave, which that he loved the more than his leave. Of eight the ten a year she was of Anja. Jalous he was and held her narwin Kanja. For she was wild and young, and he was old, and damned himself ben ling a cock a wild. He knew not Katun, for his wit was ruder, that bad man shall the wed his similitude. Men shall the wed after here a stand, for youth and eld is often at the bands. But sith that he was fallen in the snare, he most endure as other folk his car. There was this younger weave, and therewithal, as any wazel her body gent and small. A saint she weared, a barren doll of silk, a barren cloth as wind as marna milk, upon her lendus full of mania gora. Which was her smock, and broidered all before, and the ache behind on her collar abunda, of coal black silk within and ache with unta. The tapas of her wheat, volipere, were of the summer sweet of her colere, her fillet broad of silk and set full here. And secretly she had the licorous ear, full smallly pulled where her brew as two, and though were bent and blank as any slow. She was full more blissful on to say than is the new perigen at a tray, and softer than the walls of a weather. And be her girdle hang a purse of leather, to sell it with silk and perlin with latoon. In all this world, to saken open tune, there is no man so wees that could a thencha, so gay a popolun or swinch a wencha. Full brich there was the sheening of her hue, than in the tour the noble forged new. But of her song it was as loon and yerna, as any swallow was sitting on a perna. There to she could a skimp and mang a gamma, as any kind or call following his dam. Her mouth was sweet as braggant or the maith, or horned of apples laid in hay or hay. When singer she was, as is a jolly cold, long as a mass and upright as a bond. A broad she bar upon her lua colere, as broad as is the boss of a bocalere. Her shoes were lassied on her legs here. She was a primrose, a piggest near, for any lord to legend in his bed, or yet for any good ye man to wend. No sir and eft sir soon befell the cas, that on a day this hend Nicholas, full with this young weaf to range at the play, whil that her husband was at Ossinea, as clerk as penful subtil and full quenta. 
and privily he caught her by the quenta, and said, I wish but if it have me will, for der the love of the le man is spill. And held her heart by the hound upon us, and said, Leman, love me all at us, or it will be also God me save. And she sprung as a call to in the trava, and with her hand she reined fast away, and said, I will not kiss it be me fair. We lat be, quod she, lat be, Nicholas, or I will cry on haru and alas, do we your handes for your courtesy. This Nicholas can mercy for to cria, and spank so fair, and proffered him so fast, that she her love him granted at the last, and swore her oath be Saint Thomas of Kent, that she will be at his commandment, and that she may her lesser will espia. When whose bond is so full of jealousy, that put ye way to well and ben privé, ye wot richt well in ambud den, quod she. Ye must have been full dern as in this case. Neither of Carthy knocked, quod Nicholas, a clerk had literally beset his wheel, but if he could a carpenter be gill. And thus they been accorded and they sworn to wait at him as he have told before. When Nicholas had done thus every day, and thanked her about the land as well, he kissed her swain that taketh his outria, and playeth fast, and maketh melodia. Then I feel it thus that to the parish church, Christus on the workes for to wircha, this go the weave went on an holiday. Her forehead shone as bricht as any day, so was it washing when she lent her work. No was there of that church a parish clerk, the which that was a clapin absolon. Cruel was his hair, and as the gold it shone, and strutted as a fan large and brown, full straight and even lay his jolly shone. His road was rain, his eyen grey as gauze, with pool's window corving on his shoes, in hoses rain he went of fetishly. A clad he was full small and properly, all in a kirtle of a licht to a gent, full fair and thick when the point as sent. And thereupon he had a gay surplice, as wind as is the blossom upon the rees. A merry chill he was, so God me salva. Well, couldn't he lat and blow, and clip and shava, and mark in a charter of land or aqua townsa? In twenty manner could he trip and downsa, after the skull of oxen for the thaw, and with his leg is cast and to and fro, and play and song as on a small rubimla, their toe he sung some tim a lud quinimla, and as well could he play on a geterna. In all the tune as brihus ne taverna, that he ne visited with his solace, their anigale or tapest there was. But sooth to sain, he was some dales quemus, of farting and of spetcher down the roos. This absolon that jolliff was and gay, gith with a censer on the holiday, and singeth the weavers of the parish of Fasta, and many a lovely long on him he casta, and namely on this carpet there is weave. To look on her him thuch the Miriel Eve, she was so proper and swained and like a rose. I dar well seen if she had been a moose, and he a cad, he wall her hand unknown. This parish clerk, this jolly absolon, hath in his heart a switch a love longing, that of no weave tog he no one of ring, for courtesy he seen he wall the known. The mona, when it was nicht, full bricht the shun, and absolon his geterna hath a tanka, for paramours he thought them for to waka. And forth he goeth jolliff and amarus, till he come to the carpenter's hoose, a little after caucus had a crew, and dressed him up be a shot window, that was upon the carpenter's wall. He singeth in his voice gentle and small, No dare a if they will obey, I pray you that ye will or you and me, for well accordant to his gitterning. This carpenter awoke and heard him sing, and spoke unto his wife, and said that noon, 
Hwant aga son, heres tu nat absolon, dat chaunte thusun der ur buere swal. An seant swer in her husbon there with all, yes God wot John ni her in every tale. This passeth forth what while ye bent than well. Fro day to day the jolly absolon, so wooth her that him is all begone. He walketh all the nicht and all the day, he kembeth his lock is brun and mad him gay. He wooth her be menace and brocanja, and swore he wald a ben her oon a panja. He singeth brocking as a nichting gala, he sent her peemant meth and spees in alla, and wafris peeping hond out of the gleda, and for she was of tun he profrit meda. For some folk wal ben wunen for richessa, and some for strokes, and some for gentilessa. Some team to shew his lichtness and mestria, he playeth herodus upon a scaffold here. But what availeth him as in this case? She loveth so this hender Nicholas, that Absalom may blew the book his horn, and they had for his labour but a scorn. And thus she maketh Absalom her appa, and all his earnest turneth to the jabba. Full so is this proverb, it is no lea, men sen richt thus, all wave and near slea, ma keth the fair leva and to be loath. For thought that Absalom be wound or wroth, because that he fair was from her sicht, the snee and Nicholas stood in his licht. No bear they well to hend and Nicholas, for Absalom me wail and sing alas.